What's going on, people? What's going on? I just got something to say real quick. This, this is baffling me, right? Straight baffling me. Like, yo, for real, I'm a firefighter, right? Had a busy night last night. Awesome. I love it. Don't wish any bad on nobody, but I love it. If there's something going bad going to happen, I hope it's while I'm working so I can have me some fun. So, yeah, I wasn't keeping up with articles and stuff like that yesterday, but uh, I just got home, flipping through a few articles to see what's going on in the box world, what people are talking about, and I read about five articles that said the same thing, and it boggles my mind. It fucking boggles my mind, for real. It said... Mayweather was has been exposed. We finally have the template to beat Mayweather. Hmm. Hmm. How is that fucking possible? All right. When you lose in a lopsided decision, that's not controversial. When you only win about three rounds in a fight and it's not controversial, how is any type of template being exposed? Help me understand that. How is a template to beat somebody exposed when you don't even come close to winning the fight? Oh, well, if he was faster, he could have did this and he could have did that. Bullshit! You're going on ifs? Are you serious? And one article said the most disrespectful thing you could possibly say. Now, I, I'm going to say it again. I'm, I'm a fan of boxing, but if I had to pick a favorite fighter, my favorite fighter is Juan Manuel Marquez. And somebody had the audacity to say that, that uh, Miguel Cotto expose Mayweather like Juan Manuel Marquez exposed Pacquiao. Bullshit. Marquez got fucking robbed three fucking times. Robbed. I mean, booed out of the building. Did Mayweather get booed out the building? No, because everybody can see he's beating the shit out of beating the shit out of Cotto. If it wasn't for 10 ounce gloves... Mayweather probably would have knocked him out because he kept rocking his fucking head. And you want to compare him to uh, Marquez? Mark, you want to compare what Cotto tried to do to what Juan Manuel Marquez did do and got robbed. It's, it's, it's bullshit. It's bullshit. But I'm just one person. And I'm going to say it again. I'm a fuck. I'm a Juan Manuel Marquez fan. I love to watch that guy in the ring. He's a technician in the ring. He will scrap if he has to. And he's just a hard-nosed Mexican fighter. I love that guy. I watch every fight, every time he get in the ring. Even before he was big. I was watching him before he even had his first bout with Marquez. I mean, first bout with uh, Pacquiao. I mean, it is what it is. He, I'm glad Pacquiao came around to get, give Marquez notoriety because nobody wanted to talk about him back in the day. Nobody wanted to talk about how he could easily smash all the Mexican greats that were still out at the time, like Eric, the Eric Morales and, and, and uh, Antonio Barrera. It's like he could smash them. They was like, this guy is the truth, but he keeps getting robbed. And now when he hit his pinnacle... Pinnacle exposed, truthfully exposed in Pacquiao. Not once, not twice, but three fucking times. And he gets robbed three fucking times. Come on, man. Come on, man. All right. When you fight to a draw and you go down three times in a fight, what does that mean? When you come back, and go down 
several times again. And then everybody boo because you won the fight. And then you come back again and dominate. And you still get robbed of, of the fight again. That's exposure. Not, I got a couple hits in on a fighter, but I was dominated for a whole fight. That's not exposing nothing. You know, the game of boxing is hit, uh, hit and try not to be hit. Mayweather has done a great job of not being hit. Look at the punch out. I mean, look at the punch landing, landing stats. Mark, okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Miguel Cotto landed better than any other fighter has ever landed on on Pat. I mean on Mayweather, a whopping twenty one percent of his punches. That's still below an average for an average fighter. What did he expose? Nothing. He went rounds where he only landed three fucking punches. What the fuck did he expose? That's some fucking bullshit, man. That's some bullshit. Maybe I'm just venting right now. Again, I'm not really. I don't really care for uh, Mayweather, but I respect his game in the ring. Like I said, if I had to choose a favorite fighter, that that yeah, Juan Manuel Marquez. That that's who I roll with. But man, I can't even talk about this. This is just, this is just fucking stupid. But I'm out, man. Doses.